stars stepped out in style for Amphar's third annual Inspiration Gala. I'm Nicole DeBeau for The Daily Buzz on CelebBuzz.com. So many stylish celebrities at Amphar's event last night, but what we want to know is who missed the mark. Joining me now is Kristen Koch to dish out the night's hits and the misses. Hey, Kristen. Uh, so let's just jump right to it. Who were your favorite looks from last night? Sure. Well, first off, I think the clear winner of the night was Kate Hudson. She was smoking hot in this red gown. It's very revealing, but it really works well on her. She's got a smaller chest, really sexy. Um, cut out arms. I just think she nailed it. Yeah, she definitely did. She looks smoking hot. Um, another stunner who looked really hot was Alessandra Ambrosia, um, the Victoria's Secret model. She has a nice corseted black long dress. It's got a lacy um, overlay and she just looked great. It's also got a great corseted back to it. So that was a very unexpected little sexy touch. I think she's another one who really nailed it. Yeah, and actually I, I saw that she was wearing Irene Newworth jewels. I absolutely love Irene stuff. If you guys don't know about it, it's it's the best jewelry. It's beautiful. Oh yeah, the, her earrings are oh, uh, knockout. Yeah. So. And finally, then my third pick for the winners of the night was Jessica, Sarah Jessica Parker. She just really nailed it in a Chanel vintage jumpsuit. You know, the, that kind of style is very hard to pull off, but of course, Sarah Jessica Parker knows how to style it up, and I think she just looked awesome. And I loved her tassel necklace. I thought that was a very fun, modern touch. All right, Kristen. So uh, now we got to switch gears and talk about who missed the mark last night. Yes. So Katy Perry, listen, I love her. I think she's shown off a little more sophisticated style, but this one didn't quite work. I think it was kind of a throwback to a 70s flower child look that just didn't really work for me. That is, what What was she thinking? I mean, that's awful. It actually kind of looks somewhat like a, a grandmother's old Halloween costume or something. I'm not sure. Bad idea. Yeah, not a step in the right <laughs> direction for her. Yeah. All right, so and who's another, next? Another costume-like design um, was seen on Rose. I think she kind of looked like maybe she was going for a rockette kind of look. It just really didn't work. The shorts look is actually very cool for night, I think, but not when you're wearing sheer black tights and a sequin jacket with, you know, puffy shoulders. The whole look I just think was a mess. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and who's up next on the chopping block? Well, Kristen Davis is so cute, and, you know, I love that she goes for feminine styles, but here she just looks like a bridesmaid. I, I think I actually own that dress from another <laughs> wedding I was in. <laughs> oh, that's awful. I love her, but, yeah, sometimes her, uh, her looks are a bit outdated, to say the least. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, well, thanks, Kristen. And for more on Kristen's hits and misses, and for all of your entertainment news, head over to CelebBuzz.com. And don't forget, you can join the conversation on Twitter using hashtag TheDailyBuzz.